I am Gregory, and this is Pensane. On the table, it is that time of the month, and I am so excited because, well, first of all, this is Ink Journal Ink Flight for March 2023, but we have a very different sized box. Yes much smaller and i hear that good things come in small packages now before i joined uh, ink flight i heard at least once there was a pen included uh the oto tashi which actually is a, a pen i have two of them and i absolutely love them um yeah so i think there's at least a possibility that there's a pen in here, just based on the size. Usually we get these big paper products, you know, uh, notepads, no uh, notebooks, that sort of thing. So the box would necessarily be much larger, but uh, yeah, I have high hopes. So without further ado, let's dig in. inks. Oh. And they're classic literature. Oh my goodness. Yes. Okay, and I just saw, and you probably did too, um, what's included. Not a pen, but that's okay because I saw something very exciting. So we have the inks there. Oh, let's take a look at this. Oh, this is cool. So this time our sticker is themed to the cat in the hat, um, Dr. Seuss. I love that. That is so cool. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so fun. And, ooh, ooh. Yeah, so a uh, cam, uh, Compoco pocket notebook. And it's a two pack. Oh, and it looks like, oh, there's more than one sticker this month. Got a little stuck on there. We'll look at that in a moment. A set of two pocket notebooks printed, printed on ecological paper. 64 line pages. Yeah, very cool. I love that size. Awesome. <laughs> and we did have extra, <laughs> extra sticker this, stickers this month. Um, oh, okay. This is a, a rickshaw branded sticker. Got ink. And rickshaw bag works. If you've ever ordered a rickshaw bag, you know that you get one of those. Oh, cool. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> it's the lucky cat. Holding a bag, of course. Rickshaw, San Francisco. Wow, that is so cool. I love it. Love it. And it's a single pen sleeve. Oh, nice. Nice. Very, very pleased. No pen again, but how can you complain about these and the bonus stickers? Very, very cool. Okay, let's look at some inks. All right, so first up, and uh, Wearing Goal as a, as a brand um, is a Korean brand. And I 
have absolutely no experience with wearing, wearing gold, as far as I recall. <laughs> um, so this first one, and again, these are literary themed, which is awesome. Uh, so the first one is Metamorphosis. Then we have White Rabbit. And I suspect this is not white. <laughs> Pride and Prejudice. King Lear. The Great Gatsby. And you may recall that um, I've mentioned previously that my wife is an English professor and The Great Gatsby is one of her favorites. Wayfarer. And lastly, Jane Eyre. Oh, I really like, I really like the, the color palette this, this month. It's just very, very pleasing. Yeah. Um, it's fairly easy to pick out my favorites. So first we had Metamorphosis. Right there. Which is... It falls somewhere between red and brown. I love that. That's beautiful. Another favorite was King Lear one here yeah I, as you probably know I love my gray inks <laughs> now I, I do have to say that that's a that's about as close to white as you can get with an ink <laughs> but I would have very real concerns about the practicality of that ink um, it would be interesting to see it come out of a pen, though. So, yeah. <clears throat> this Pride and Prejudice is just so vibrant. My goodness, that's, that's pretty amazing. Um, would I get it, though? I, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. The Great Gatsby is a, a nice blue leaning purple. I would possibly get this one, but I don't know. It's kind of similar to some that I already have. Wafer. I'm I'm not sure what uh, literary reference that is. My wife would know. <laughs> uh, that's beautiful, though. Um, that's almost. It's like a teal leaning turquoise, <laughs> um, which might be enough to put it into territory worth adding to my collection. Um, it could be different enough. I'll have to check my ink swatches, but uh, yeah, very interesting. And this Jane Eyre, that's, that's, a, that's a lovely color. <laughs> very nice. I like it, but again, I like, much like this one, although not nearly as much, um, 
I don't I wonder how practical that would be um, there are hints along the the edge there you can see sort of a dark halo forming um, so coming out of a pen it's probably much more legible than than an ink swatch um, as some people have stated ink swatches can actually be a little misleading um, or sometimes a lot misleading <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, wow, very cool. So we got a bunch of stickers couple of pocket notebooks and a single pen sleeve. I just discovered the the lining. Oh and <laughs> I was just looking at this side. <laughs> um, yes it's, it's branded uh, Ink Journal and Rickshaw. That's awesome. And the the lining is this nice purple that really fits in with couple of these ink colors. <laughs> Very cool. Again, I'm super, super happy. At this rate, I, I will never, ever stop this sub subscription. Super, super fun. I highly recommend it. Be sure and check out inkjournal.com and subscribe to Ink Flight. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you will not be sorry. My goodness. Um, Again, I love this this color palette this month. It's just very pleasing to my eyes. <laughs> and there's at least a couple inks that I will definitely be getting. So, yeah, maybe even three. Yeah, all right. Well, thank you so much for watching. This has been the Ink Flight for March 2023. And I will see you next time.